Capricorn, hey, it's your girl. Back with your weekly reading. Okay, so you know my readings is just considered as a heads up. This may resonate with you and it may not resonate with you. If it don't resonate with you, guess what? Check your other signs, okay? So listen, I've already laid out your spread, honey, okay? And your middle card is what life wants you to know right now. And this card right here is your overall energy of the reading, okay? And y'all know we're going to confirm everything with the witch's tarot, okay? So let's jump in and see what you got going on, Capricorn, Capricorn. Ooh. Okay, so listen. Middle card, what life wants you to know right now, it says put the fucking phone down. Too much screen time is making you awkward and sad. Go talk to a live person. Or listen to me. <laughs> the overall energy is the player's card. Okay, let's see what's going on. So listen, Capricorn. I feel like that you've been all up in your head trying to make some choices, okay? And trying to make the right decision because this is all about making the right decision and making the wrong decision, okay? The choice is yours, okay? And I feel like that you're walking away from a situation that no longer serves you, okay? I feel like that that's the choice that you made to leave the situation that no longer serves you. Somebody could still be running behind you, trying to talk to you, you feel me? Because they know that they didn't left you out in the cold, okay? They know that they left you out in the cold, but this tire moment happened there, okay? This tire moment happened, and when the tire moment happened, that's the universe throwing you out of that situation because it ain't for you. Okay, so this, the, the universe will make um, a situation come to an end because it's not like um, it's not for you, honey. That ain't what the universe has in store for you. They got something better in store for you, okay? So that wasn't for you. So that's why you're supposed to leave the situation, okay? So I feel like that you got that clarity. You, you, you know, I feel like that you balanced yourself out and you got that clarity that you needed you went within and you found that balance okay and now you, you know i see that you're working on yourself or if you ain't working on yourself making sure that you all the way together okay then that's what you need to do okay work on yourself okay but i feel like that you have been found that balance and i feel like that you have been working on yourself okay because i feel like that you knew that that was an illusion and you was all up in your head about this person that you know that you've been dealing with I feel like that you, you know, it was an illusion. It, you you figured that out, okay? You feel you figured out that it wasn't what you thought it was. You was just all up in your head, for real, for real, okay? And you decided to make that choice. You made the choice, okay, to walk away. To walk away because you know that that person was a player. Okay. <laughs> that's what happened. Yeah, that's what happened. Okay, so we're going to confirm everything with the witch's tarot, but that's what I see right here. So let's figure out what's going on. But it says put the phone down, so you're probably sad that you walked away. Okay, but the universe got something else better for you. Okay, it wasn't for you. You were supposed to walk away from it. As bad as it hurt, as bad as you didn't want to. Okay, but listen, you figured out that that wasn't for you because you know that that person was a player. That person wasn't no good. Or they, if, even if they wasn't a player, they was too cocky. You know what I'm saying? They just wasn't for you. Okay? Just too cocky. Alright. So, let's see. Alright. Why is the seven of cups here? Why is the seven of cups here for Capricorn? Why is the seven of cups here for Capricorn? We gotta figure it out. We're about to figure it out. We're about to figure it out. I told you somebody ooh, listen, last week I told you that somebody wanted to work on on something with you. Like somebody wanted to work with you on something, right? And that was this person right here, honey. Right? That was this person that you decided to walk away from. So you done walked away from that person and I told you that that person is trying to follow behind you like, Hey, come here, what's going on? Why this got in? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you're like, uh-uh. Because, see, you didn't let me out in the cold because you're doing too much. Okay? You're doing too much. <laughs> but the universe calls that because they got something better in store for you. I told you, you were study hanging on to things that you were supposed to let go. Okay? You was you were study trying to, you know, keep things going that you needed to let go. And then now you done finally got that clarity and you done balance things out within in yourself because you done took the time to step back and work on yourself. Okay? Because you knew that it was all up in your head. 
but you were still ready to pursue it and move forward with it but you know you ended up getting that clarity okay because like i'm saying you was you was sitting up there trying to hold on to things that you know you needed to let go okay and when a honey when the universe step in you ain't got no choice but to let it go because they're gonna make you let it go <laughs> okay all right come on let's keep going let's see what's up did i show y'all this i'm gonna confirm everything with the witch's tarot i'm up here running my mouth but that's what i see why the seven of cups here why the seven of cups here for capricorn seven of cups why the seven of cups here I need new cards. My friend's about to send me some. She see that I do the witch's tarot, and she was like, hey, "Friend, I'm gonna send you these cards." I was like, "Okay, girl." <clears throat> I love the witch's tarot, but I'm gonna try to switch some things up. Oh, shit! Ah, see what I'm telling you? You know the cards don't lie. The cards don't lie. I got this deck. I might start using this one. Maybe next week. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, but look, this is what you got. Okay, listen, you didn't, you, you made a choice because I'm telling you, that person was handing off player energy. That's what your overall reading is about. So, you know, you was all up in your head about it. You know what I'm saying? And you was thinking about it and you was trying to, you know, figure things out, you know. And that person was, uh, had third party energy going on. Okay, that's what you got clarity on. That person had a, a third party situation on and it was bringing too much motherfucking chaos too much chaos okay that could have been arguing and fighting or you could have been arguing and fighting with his look with whoever he was bringing in or she was bringing in on the third party situation okay and you walked away because you was like uh-uh nope i deserve better i'm walking away from this okay because you feel like that person left you out in the cold and now they trying to run behind you probably trying to get you to come back but that tire mama was supposed to happen like i said and you didn't have clarity honey because you were steady trying to hang on to something that you needed to let go and now you didn't balance that out within yourself and if you ain't then you need to okay i'm just the messenger <laughs> i'm just the messenger all right why the five of pentacles here why the five of pentacles here for capricorn five of pentacles for capricorn Look at her. See what you got? You got the empress, honey. This is you're loving and caring, and you know that, okay? You could even have kids with this person. You could even have kids with this person, honey, but you know that you are a loving and caring person. That's why you had to walk away from this situation because you like, you know, y'all could either have kids together and you like, okay, we got kids together, but so what? You know, like I know who I am. You see how she's sitting there? Okay. Come on now. She like, mm mm. I gotta leave this alone. You walked away from the situation, right? Because you're feeling like that a person was uh, shortchanging you, okay? A person was just giving you, offering you anything. They wasn't being fair, you know? Or you could have been, uh, you could have been putting in more than what they was. You feel me? Like they wasn't putting the same energy that you was putting into it, right? They were shortchanging you. But you know that. And then, and then that tower moment happened, but you got that clarity. And you was like, I'm about to let it go. Because you know that that person's a player, okay? Or cocky. Either or. Let's keep going. Why's the tower card here? Why's the tower card here? Why's the tower card here? Yeah. Good Capricorn. Good Capricorn. Good Capricorn. Let's see. See what I'm talking about? Hey, 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 hey. That's what you got. Listen, buddy. Listen. You done took action fast. I told you that tire, that tire moment happened and it happened fast, okay? It happened fast because, listen, that person was childish. That person could have been stepping on your toes, honey. That person was childish, okay? And then now they probably want to come back and deliver a message or something. You know what I'm saying? Uh-uh. A messenger. <laughs> I don't need your message because guess what? This is what you did or she did. Broke your heart. Okay? So you dug down within and you used that wisdom and the knowledge that you have, honey. And you dug down within and you made the decision because you got that clarity that you needed. Okay? Because you knew that you was trying to hang on to something that you needed to let go. 
But you you balanced that shit out. You balanced it out because you know that that person was a player and ain't no good for you. Okay, I have the Ace of Swords here. I have the Ace of Swords here for the cat. Ace of Swords for the cat. Ace of Swords, here's the Capricorn. Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords, here's the Capricorn. Ace of Swords, here's the Capricorn. <laughs> See what I'm talking about? See what I'm talking about? See what I'm talking about? Look, that's what you got. Okay. That's what I'm saying. You got clarity, right? And you knew that you needed to move. It took you a little time. You know what I'm saying? You had to sit back and think about it for a minute. But you knew that you needed to move. You need, you know that you needed to start taking action on leaving, okay? Which was to take a leap of faith, okay? You had to take a leap of faith because you balanced it out within yourself. You found that balance, okay? And you had to step into your power and know who the, who the hell you are because this is the star. You know that you are the star, okay? You're the star, and you had to balance that out within you, okay? Because you was probably giving more than this person was giving, okay? And then you didn't realize that, uh-uh. See, because this person's playing, and I know who I am, okay? And you are the star, honey. You are the star. You didn't found that balance, okay? No cap, Capricorn. <laughs> Let me go play it. Come on. Why is the temperance card here? Why is the temperance card here? The temperance card. The temperance card. The temperance card. Put it, Capricorn. Here we go. Mm, 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 mm. This is what you got, honey. Okay? Listen, you found that balance. You found that balance because that person was sitting on a high horse, honey, and probably getting recognized by other people. Okay, so you balance that out. You found that balance because you knew that it was stressing you out. The balance that you found is that you knew that that was stressing you out, or if it wasn't stressing you out, it was gonna bring stress. Okay, and this is what you want right here. You want somebody that you can build an empire with. You don't want to be stressed out. That's what you balanced out. This is what you want because you know that this is what you deserve. Okay, you see, you stepped into your power and you knew that you deserve better. Okay. This is inspiration. This is, you know, um, knowing who you are, like stepping into your power, okay? Come on now. And you don't want this. You don't want stress. You don't want to be stressed. You want to be loved and somebody that you can build an empire with, okay? And that's a good thing, honey, that you realize what was going on before it was too late. Because, you know, sometimes we'll be all in. Ain't nobody got time for that. Let's keep going. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here for Capricorn? Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? The Eight of Pentacles for Capricorn. <laughs> Told you. You've been working on yourself, honey. Look at you looking good. Okay. You're looking good, honey, because you worked on yourself. You know who you are, honey. You know that you don't need nobody. Like, you've got your, you got your stable, honey. you got your money, your house, what, you, everything. You looking beautiful, okay? You are all the way together. This is a bad mama jama right here, okay? Like I said, you was working on yourself. And you did just that because you know who you are, okay? You know what you deserve. And this is what you're going after right here. The universe is handing this to you. This is abundance, money. Ooh, didn't I tell you last time that you had that money coming in? See? Mm-hmm. You got it coming in, honey, and you looking good. I'm telling you. You got, an, you got some abundance coming in. I don't know if it's a house, a car, uh, money, what it is. But that was in your last reading about that money, honey. And this is what the universe is ready to hand you now. Because guess what? You stepped in your power and you, you start taking care of yourself. And, you know, paying yourself attention and, you know, loving yourself. Just working on you. Putting that work in on you. Because you realize that, that whatever that situation that you was in... You realize that it was just an illusion. It was just all in your head. That it was time to let it go. Okay. Somebody said, "I don't want to let it go, Crystal." On the last, <laughs> on the last reading. Well, I, I see you have, honey. And you go, girl. Okay. Let's keep going. Watch the moon card here. 
has a moon card here. Has a moon card here for that point. The moon card. Has a moon card here for that point. Moon card. Moon card. Has a moon card here. There they go with that thing again. I told you, as soon as I start doing readings, he start playing that little trumpet thing, whatever he got. The moon card. See what I see? It was probably just all about sex, honey. Sex. <laughs> it wasn't what you really thought it was, okay? It was probably just all about you know sex like the sex was probably good you know what i'm saying and y'all probably just had a lot of passion for each other you know what i'm saying that was it that was all so you had to you know say uh-uh you made the choice to you made the decision to leave it alone because it was just passion okay it wasn't love it wasn't your person that's why i told you the universe took that away from you that wasn't your person Sorry about the little trumpet thing that he's playing. I'm sorry. And this is California. The house is super close together. Okay. Why is the two of wands here? Why is the two of wands here? The two of wands. Why is the two of wands here? That's what you got gone Capricorn see I told you you made a decision because you you seen the situation for what it really was and you knew that it was gonna be it was gonna become a burden okay you knew it was gonna become a burden so guess what you got your stability together honey and guess what cut things out that no longer served you okay and you found that strength to leave the situation alone because you know that that person was being passionate about other things, okay? But you got love coming in. You have love coming in, honey. And you are going to be happy. So just be patient, okay? You got this. All right, Capricorn. That's your reading, baby. Okay? I hope it resonated with you. If it did, you can leave me a comment and let me know what's going on if you want to. Or if not, just make sure that you hit the like button, okay? If you like it, if it resonated with you. And even subscribe. If you ain't subscribed to my channel, come on, man. Subscribe. Fuck with your girl. Subscribe so you can be notified whenever my next videos come out, okay? Alright, Capricorn, that's your reading. And guess what? Have a blessed day.